Hi everyone, this is the gas walkthrough for July 7th. I'm Philip Newman. Today I'm solving Coded Pair Sudoku by Bill Murphy. This one's a little different, um, but we have normal Sudoku rules, one to nine in each row, column, and three by three box. Additionally, we have some cages in the grid, and these are not killer cages. Um, these are marking pairs of digits that are the same when the cages have matching letters. So for example, this cage is an E, this cage is an E, this cage is an E. So all three of these cages are going to contain the same pair of digits. They don't have to appear in the same order. These are not clones, but they do contain the same two digits. So those are the rules. And we're gonna get started with our cages that have digits in them. So this is an A, it has a 1 in it, but this is an A and it has a 2 in it. So we need a 1 in this cage and we need a 2 in this cage. This is a B, it has a 3 in it. This is a B, it has a 4 in it, so we need a 3 and a 4, like that. C has a 5 and a 7. D has a 6 and an 8. And I don't think we have any other cages of those types. Is that right? All right. So looking at this box, uh, I can see we have a six and a four here looking over. So that's going to have to be a pair in the box. The remaining digits are going to be three, eight, and nine. This one can't be eight. This one can't be three. So we know we have a three in the E cage somewhere. So there's a three here. There's a three here, but it can't go here. So that's three. And then this is eight or nine. So three, eight, nine. Ah, and there's an eight here. So our pair is three, nine. That's not eight. This is an eight. Okay, so that's the E cage. Uh, but we can do something similar with the F. So we have three and eight here looking in. So three, eight go in the corners. Our remaining digits are four, six, and nine. And in the F cage, I can see we have a six here. So this can't contain six, and this can't contain six. So this is a four, nine pair. This is six. This is a four, nine pair. And this is a four, nine pair, but here we have a four. So that is resolved. All right, looking down, we have two, five. Can't go in these cells. So our remaining digits are 1, which has to go here, because of these 1s, and then 7 and 9. Uh, we have a J here. Is that the only J? Yeah. Uh, but there's a 9 looking at this cage. So this is 7, and this is 9. And we have a 1, 7 pair here, here. The 1 resolves 7 and 1. All right. The I here. We've got 1, 7. So 1 and 7 go here. In fact, we know the order of those. We probably know the order of these, too. These are 2, 5, and 9. And the 2 must go here because of these 2s. Uh, in fact, we can find the order immediately from the 3, 9. We could have done this down here, too. This is 5. This is 9. And so our I cage contains 2 and 5. And we know the order from that 2 there. All right, H contains a five, and it doesn't go here, so this is five. This is three or eight. Uh, so these are the same. The G cage contains a seven, so that's a seven. This is four or six. And that is all the cages. Oh, we have a four here, so G is six, and we have a three here, so this is eight. This is an eight. Three there, four there. Okay, now that's all the cages. We just need to do some Sudoku to get the orders. This is nine. Up here we have five and eight. You know the order of those. These are one and seven. This is a four. That four looks down to give us nine and four. Down here, six and seven. These are two and five. And we have a three here. The three looks up to resolve that. Last digit on a six is a nine. Um, three and eight here. Don't know yet. 
to four and six. Okay, this is a seven. This is a five. We have six and eight here. We have six and eight here as well. So that's going to give us a six, eight pair and resolve these. It gives us eight here, six, eight, six, eight, and this is a six. These are one, two, three, and these are four, one, and two. That's the solution. So neat puzzle by Bill. Um, I don't know that I've ever solved a coded pair Sudoku before, and I didn't test this one. Um, so hope you found that as neat as I did. Uh, let us know how you did in the comments, and I will see you next time.